50 points uh, in the second half. What was kind of the feeling? What was the vibe um, as you guys made that run and obviously shut their offense down? Um, I mean, we were just uh, playing playing together. You know, we had each other's backs out there. Um, you know, everybody was communicative. Communicative. That's a tricky one. <laughs> that's, a, that's a tricky one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so everybody was on the same page. Go ahead. Can you take us through the block? Yeah, I, I mean, that's a two-person play, really. Um, you know, it's a go on my highlights, but that's really chalked up to Monte too, because Monte he's the one that walled him off. You know, just uh, make him step over instead of letting him get that dunk. Just how he had a euro step and then lay the ball up, so I could just come clean it up. And then you sent it over the Nuggets bench. So did you notice the reactions and, and how everybody was so hyped about it? Yeah, that's why I love this scene. You know, everybody celebrates each other's <laughs> success. Did anybody's celebration stand out? Uh, no, it's just yeah. it's good to see it all together. Yeah. And did it feel like? Uh, do you? How much more comfortable did you feel with this version? Like you, you had the whole off season, and it seemed like everything was starting to come together. You just spoke to it on the defensive end, offensively. You guys were cooking too. Like, did it feel more comfortable out there? Yeah, it did. It, did. Um, it felt like everybody's on the same page. Um, we're playing for each other, and um, you know that's the best way to play. You know, it's good basketball. And, and, that's the first thing I noticed when I, I uh, joined the team is just the brand of basketball is just it's pure, you know. So when we're playing that way, um, the game guys is on our side. Was it sweet to silence the road crowd a little bit, particularly this one? Oh yeah, so, <laughs> so there's a couple of fans out there flipping me the bird. Were they? Yeah, love it. Did you wink at them? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> love it. Need it. Where did you find your spots tonight, Aaron? I mean, like you're set twelve six and or 12 eight and four where did you feel like you found your spots in that starting group and not just scoring but finding your teammates and getting boards um well i can find my spots on the offensive glass um i can find my spots running in transition uh, spot up threes uh, cuts um and then there's a couple of uh, spots that i still need to pick in um, at coast to coast you know i can take advantage of that uh, when I get the ball off the rim, I, I can dribble it down. Um, and then it basically turns into iso isolation uh, for the first, we'll say, eight seconds of the play clock. So it takes five to get it up, and then I'm isolated for three or four seconds. So, um, <clears throat> yeah, so the first nine seconds. And then it, if nothing happens, and I kick it out, and, and we can go to the second action. So I'm going to look to uh, attack the work there. Um, and then unders as well. They went under on me one time. Uh, but, you know, I got downhill and I kicked it to Tay in the corner. So it, was, it ended up being a good play. Yeah, it's one game, but you've got the team that won the West on the other side, you're on the home floor, and, and we were talking to Coach Malone about kind of the narrative that without the ball, people are, are wondering, you know, how far can the Nuggets take it? Is this a game where you end up, you know, sizing yourself up against them and, and trying to send a message about, about what y'all can do this year? Uh, you know, it's, it's definitely one that we wanted to get. Uh, start off on the right foot. Uh, you know, a little payback. Uh, we'll see him again. Just one game. Uh, on to the next. Aaron Mike uh, tied a career high with five assists. One of them was to you in the corner uh, on the transition. Uh, what did you make of his playmaking? He impressed at all. What he you know brought back after the offseason? Yeah, it's a great sign. Great sign and seeing that Mike distribute the ball and play make like that. And I told him um, the more that he distributes the ball, the more open he'll be. Mm -hmm. You know. Uh, He's getting five, five assists, six assists. Now the help doesn't rotate as fast, you know? So now he's just shooting over one, and he makes that. All right, go ahead to the Zoom for a couple, Stephen. What, uh, Leonardo Torres? Hey, Aaron, it's Leonardo Torres from Peru. Congrats on the win. Aaron, what are your thoughts on the defense in the second half of the game? I thought we were tied together. You know, everybody was on the string. Um, we were all talking to each other, and um, you know, it's just a, it's just a, a foreshadowing of what we can be. Next, we'll go to Crystal Saltis. Hello, Aaron. Congratulations on the win. Thank you. Uh, 
What kind of statement for you as a team was that win with the way that you won, won tonight potential-wise? It was a, a great team win. You know, we had to go um, <clears throat> through a little bit of adversity early in the game, early in the half, um, but we just stuck with it. So, um, you know, if we play the right way, down the stretch of the game, it's going to be within two, three, four, four points. Um, this time we happen to just uh, open it up a little bit more down the stretch. All right, last one for you, Aaron. We'll go to Tyler Baronski with Fan Sighted. Hey, Aaron. I uh, actually want to ask you about Jeff Green. Uh, what has it been like for you to reconnect with him on another team and just what a guy like that can mean to a team that has – you know, high uh, aspirations and goals uh, this season? It's been amazing. Um, Jeff is uh, just a great guy, you know. Uh, as, as great as he is as a basketball player, he's an even better person. Um, we're both in different places in our lives um, than we were in Orlando. So, um, you know, we, we are, uh, he's just a huge help to me, you know. Um, he wants to see me succeed, and I want to see him succeed as well. So, uh, we both got each other's back. We're both looking out for each other. And um, I mean, he's just dope to have in the locker room. It's just dope to have uh, on the bench and, and out there playing because he's just so smart, uh, so talented, um, and just, just hit it. It's great all around person. Awesome. Thanks, Aaron. Thanks, Eugene. Right, no problem. Man, I haven't used the word community.